Okay. So, I uploaded a video showing my makeup. Oh, no, no, no. I'm trying to show you. But, um, I'm new to this and I didn't know how to merge the pictures with the video. And you can't just upload a picture. It has to be the video. So, I guess that was a lost cause or whatever. Now, um... You have to excuse me because I am holding my iPod Touch while trying to make a video in the bathroom because this is the only quiet place in the house even though it's like 4 o'clock in the morning. My son is asleep. Well, my boyfriend is up and he's watching his movie so it's loud in the bathroom. Um, let's see, I have a couple things going on. Um, I cut my hair. See, the last time, the last video, yeah, I had on the yellow shower cap but I had a weave on. I had a sew in and it was my first one, like my first one ever. And I'm 30. And it was my last one because it was nasty. But right after I got that out, I literally chopped off my hair. Like it's a 4B, C, whatever. I'm not going to say it's a natural hair journey, but right now it's natural. Um, if you watched my second video where it's like me, my boyfriend, and my son, my hair is like down here. And it was in need of a perm, so it probably would have been, like, down to there if it was straight. And now it's, well, yeah, you get the point. It's short. But when I have it straightened, it's not that bad. It's a cute little bob. It's, like, right here with little bangs. It's cute. I like it. I like my curly hair, too. So I love it, actually. Um... After a while, you can actually really see it's kind of defined. But, um, I am part of a group, two groups, um, called God's Girls, um, on Facebook, and that is led by Erica Snooty, Texas Cutie 75. Yeah, I absolutely adore her. And, um, um, yeah, shout out to all the Texas girls because I was raised in San Antonio, so yeah, kind of miss it, but whatever. And um, <laughs> um, but that's not what I'm gonna talk about. I'm gonna talk about the detox. Um, I had called myself trying to start it a couple weeks ago, I was gonna make the green smoothies and all that, but $500 is a lot to spend on a blend tech blender, I don't care how good it is. Um, but I do want one. But I went into tax time. And, you know, I watched Erica's videos and she said you don't need the fancy blenders. And a lot of people say that. You don't need the fancy blenders to do it. Um, so I tried to uh, make a smoothie in the blender I already had. Mm -mm. No. It definitely is not meant to blend anything green. Anything leafy, the blades just stop. Like it gets clogged, it's done, it's not going to dry. Anything mushy. I, I don't know what that blender is good for, actually. So, <laughs> it, it, it don't do nothing. So, um, I'm going to invest a little bit of money. I think it's like $50. No, no, no. I want to get a Ninja Pulse. I think that might be good. I think it's like a blender and a food processor. I heard a lot of good reviews. Um, that's $80. Uh, $79.99, whatever. At Walmart and Target. Um, or I might get a... Well, Oyster? O-S-T-E-R. Oster? Whatever. Blender. I heard good reviews on those. And those are like fairly cheap. At like 30... Between 30 and 60. Depending, or higher. Depending on what model you get. Um, I guess because it's... After Christmas, I have noticed that the Blendtex, a certain model that I want, has gone down from $4.99 to like $3.70 something. So, like I said, tax time comes. I'm definitely going to get that. Um, I would say it's between the Blendtex and the Vitamix, but I know this is kind of biased, but um, like every time I do go out and get like a smoothie... Or, like, even if I go to Starbucks, I am a Starbucks fanatic, and I'm going to have to control that if I actually plan on doing a full detox. But, like, 
those are the type of blenders they have. They have like the blend tech. Even at like um Jumbo Juice. Is it's either Jumbo Juice or Smoothie King. The one we have it here in uh, Memphis, Tennessee. They use the blend tech. They don't use the Vitamix. So I'm gonna go with them. And um we're gonna see how that goes. But like I said, tomorrow, or rather later on today, because like I said, it's one in the morning. I'm going to go to Walmart or Target and get a blender and I am going to start I don't know if I'm going to start my detox, detox tomorrow but um, I definitely all have my fruits and veggies I have all that stuff cut up frozen in separate containers in the freezer waiting um, got my water jugs and all that stuff so tomorrow is today wait hold on hold on today is Tuesday tomorrow's Wednesday i probably start on Wednesday. Maybe get everything out of my system. Maybe have some chocolate and a steak tomorrow. You know, kind of before I can't. Because mm -hmm. as Erica says, fruits, veggies, water, that's it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, technically chocolate is a vegetable, right? Because it comes from the cocoa beans. It comes out the ground. Can I get away with that? Probably not. But okay. If you want to be scientific about it. Mm. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So, oh, and I found out that with, this is a side note, way side note. This right here, like I said, this is the iPod Touch. See, can you see it? Probably can't see it. No, yes, yeah, the bathroom's messy. But, um, this thing downloads videos with a quickness. Like I was downloading those first two videos I downloaded with my son and then the three of us together, they took like four or five hours to download and they were already on the computer. But um, the video that I uploaded about how I was gonna do makeup but then there was no picture of it, that took literally like two minutes cause it was coming off the iPod to the computer and oh, I love it. I, I have bought this, the iPod Touch for him for uh christmas but uh, i think i might have to renege and take it back or you know use it for myself or whatever and um i love my hair it has got some color in it too oh, i think i have add whatever but um yes yes wish me luck i will be making way more videos um Hopefully I can get my boyfriend on one of them and I will introduce you to my son because he's, he's grown from the video you've seen. He's three. Ball of energy. Dion. You'll have to see for yourself because he is out there. He's my child, you know. Love him. And that's a whole other story. I'm going to tell you all about Dion in another story because this is already eight minutes of me just jabbing away. And, um... Wish me luck, YouTubers. <laughs>